Hi, this is Mike Bellamy, recording from my office in South China. After 10 years living here as a sourcing agent, I decided to publish my experience in a book in order to help others to achieve their goals more easily. If you are importing products from China and would like a comprehensive guide to best practices and common pitfalls, then this book is for you. Now let me tell you a bit about why I wrote the Essential Reference Guide to China Sourcing. It's different from any other guidebook available at this time. There are two kinds of China sourcing books out there. The first group is available at any major bookstore between 15 and 35 US dollars, makes a very interesting read as we follow the authors on their China business adventures. Um, these books, and here's one of my favorites, do an excellent job of helping the reader get a feel for the dangers and opportunities in China, but they don't go so far as to give practical tips in the form of templates and procedures to avoid the dangers and capture the opportunities they talk about in their book. The second group of books are often in the form of ebooks or PDF files written by sourcing experts. Now they do start to cover specific tips and checklists. These materials range in price from free to $30. Most are junk and others are worth the small asking price if the reader needs some general and basic pointers to get started. My goal in writing the Essential Reference Guide to China Sourcing was to provide the interesting stories and personal experiences like the first group of books, but I wanted to add actual procedures and best practices at a level of detail and professionalism not found in any of the typical ebooks mentioned above. What makes me an authority on China sourcing? First off, China is so big and constantly changing that when someone claims to be a China expert, I don't always believe it. I moved to Asia in 1993 and have been living here pretty much full time since then. Early on in my career, I made a lot of mistakes. I paid too much for products. I had my ideas knocked off. I missed delivery dates, you name it. So I'm not here to say that I'm perfect or know everything. Rather, I'm here to say you can learn from my mistakes. Um, and thus, you will have a much better chance to achieve your goals for price, quality, and lead time while protecting your intellectual property. As a bit of a background, in 2001, I founded Passage Maker Sourcing Solutions in South China with one client and about $2,000 on loan from a family member. Today, we have just under 200 employees and we are responsible for managing around 200 million US dollars worth of goods in China. Besides a lot of hard work and learning by trial and error over the past decade, one key reason for the success of PassageMaker is my emphasis on standard operating procedures, templates, and checklists for every action performed by the employees of my company. The Essential Reference Guide to China Sourcing is based on the operation manual at PassageMaker, which is hundreds of pages long and instructs my staff in great detail how to do things like prepare a contract, place purchase orders, hold a factory meeting, conduct product inspections, manage projects, attend a trade show, and so on. All of these tools and strategies are included in this guidebook. The Essential Reference Guide to China Sourcing is easy to understand, but it is not a quick one-hour read. On the contrary, it is a comprehensive manual for every aspect of running a sourcing agency or purchasing office. This book has real value if you're getting started in sourcing or if you want a benchmark of your existing operations. If you're having trouble justifying the purchase of my book, just think about the cost of not purchasing the book. How much money would you lose if you get a shipment of junk? What if the product is delayed out of China? What if your intellectual property is stolen? Readers of my book will have a concrete, practical, and affordable tool to prevent those everlasting nightmares. As you can see from the size of the book, it is a substantial offering. Let me give you some examples. Some of the other books may say it's important to find a good supplier. Nice tip. But what about the actual steps involved? In my book, not only do I explain how to define what is the ideal supplier for you, but I provide the actual template taken from my company's operation manual and provide case studies walking the reader step by step through a typical project rollout. Other books simply don't offer this level of detail. Let me give you two more examples of the level of detail provided in my book. Some guidebooks say things like, have a contract in place that defines what you're ordering. Yeah, no, no, that's another no-brainer, but what should this contract look like, you may be asking. Well, on page 100 of my book, you will find an actual contract template in both English and Chinese that you can cut and paste for your own business. Another guidebook says, make sure to do a quality check before you ship. Another no-brainer, but you are left asking yourself, what should a product inspection cover and how to manage the details? On page 208 of my book, you'll find an actual inspection report that you can use as a template in your own business. 
Thank you for watching this video and thanks for your interest in the Essential Reference Guide to China Sourcing. I am confident you will enjoy the book and I wish you successful sourcing in China. If you have any specific questions about the book or sourcing in general, please don't hesitate to contact me. I look forward to being of service.